Hey guys, so today we're going to play Mono Black Control. I haven't played it in a while, so I wanted to try out what people have been doing lately. I went on the most recent league. I found a guy who went 5-0. Um, I pretty much did an exact copy of his list, except for I changed some of his swamps for Bajuku Bogs because he had zero, and he only had one to hill spell bomb in the sideboard, so I just wanted a little bit more graveyard hate. But, um, yeah, the list is sweet. Uh, we have a lot of early plays with also, like, Unearth to bring some of these creatures back in case they get killed early. Uh, two Thorn of the Black Rose, the full play set of the Grey Merchants, and then one Okiba game, Shinobi main deck for uh, additional hand hate main deck. Sideboard, we got four Duress, two Distress for, uh, uh, for hand hate, two Crypt Rats for Field Wipes, Three Choking Sands for uh, Tron, pretty much, I'm guessing. Uh, two Liliana Spectres, which hand hates as well. Additional Thorn of the Black Rose and then the Hill Spell Bomb. Uh, we're going to give this a try and see how it works out. Um, please like and subscribe if you have not yet. It helps out the channel grow quite a bit. Uh, I'm going to try to do... Better this month. Last month, I kind of took a few breaks, went out of town for a little bit. Uh, this month, I'm going to try to post every day. And, uh, I mean, well, the next 30 days, I'm going to try to post every day. And we're going to see if we can get back on track with growing the site. I'm also going to try to do a little bit more editing. My apologies. My last, like, two or three weeks, I didn't do much editing, if no editing at all. All right. I'll see you guys soon. All right, uh, I think we can keep this. Sure. Play Witch's turn two. Painter's Edict's fine. Play Rager. Alright, so we're going to go Thorn of the Black Rose. Wing for two. And see how he deals with the Monarch at this point. He's not set up yet. And if he plays his Guardian, we have the Chainer's Edict for it. Okay, so we're probably just going to swing. This is actually going to probably be pretty good for us. We might just use Sign and Bloods to kill him. It might actually work. Gainer's Edict, them. Back for three. Pass turn. Oh, that's pretty bad for us. <laughs>
I hate. Oh, feels so bad. So we're definitely bringing in all the duresses and distress, and probably Liliana specters. Does he have another guardian? I swear. He has another pestilence. We're probably in trouble too. Let's do this. Wow. Okay, so he's got... Yeah, we're going to move on to the next game. Okay, so we want all of this, this, this. Don't need defiles or disfigures. Don't need witches. I don't think I need tendrils either. Maybe we want to do land destruction. Yeah, the land destruction might actually be better than unearth. Okay, that's how we're going to run it. Yes, I'd like to go first. I will keep. We will take duress and take Night's Whisper next. Saints Whisper, play Bajukabog, targeting them. Item blood ourselves, hopefully get a land.
really want Distress to hit this Palace Sentinels. But since we didn't get it, I think I'd prefer land. There we go, Distress is perfect. I got that Palace Sentinels. He's going to play Guardian, at least he should. He did not, okay. I think I like Animal Blood again. Choking Sands. Now he can't cast his Guardian. All right, so now we're gonna go Chittering Rats. Into Ray Merchant. We totally uh, should have gone for Okiba Gang last turn, by the way. Chittering Rats.
That should be game. Okay, there you go. All right, welcome. Uh, we have lots of hand hate, even though our land is slow. So I think I might keep this. Keep. Perfect. So we'll duress. Journey of Nowhere, I don't really care about. Castigate is what I care about. So we'll take Castigate. Then there's Disfigure, Journey of Nowhere, Chainer's Edict, lots of removal. But we'll wait a little bit before doing anything else. Hopefully we draw land so we can play one of these and cycle the other one. Or we'll just play this. We're not going to cycle this just yet, just in case that we um, need it. And then blood ourselves. Play the land. Now we can cycle this without worrying about needing it too much. Then we can start doing uh, chittering rats. Well, I mean, that's a thing. His hand's full of removal, so realistically, we need our own uh, Thorn of the Black Rose for this to work. For us to come back from this. Because his hand is just full of removal, and he's going to be... Ugh, that's annoying. Sure. Whatever you say, buddy. I think we're going to go Rager next turn, just to try to get to our second land. Or not, we'll probably, we'll distress him. Take Guardian. Play Chittering Rats. Play land. Play Chittering Rats. Play Guess Verdict. I didn't want to play the second one because he could have gone Crypt Rats, crack it for two. Which I don't, I think we want to use, have him use the Crypt Rats for like one creature type of thing. The rest isn't going to do anything. We know his two cards currently are. So we need Thorn of the Black Rose right now.
the rest. Take Castigate. Hopefully he has to use Crypt Rats to keep it alive. I mean, to keep the Monarch. Oh, you had Flashback Cheaner's Edict now? Okay, sure. That's a thing. Come on, Thorn of the Black Rose. Just draw it for me. I mean, that's kind of funny. I kind of like that. Come on, Thorn, right now. Thorn. This is harder to kill, I guess. Probably going to have to block with that guy. Dude, we would win this so bad if we could just draw one of our three Thorn of the Black Rose. Wow. 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 Okay. Sure. Whatever. Rest doesn't do anything. I don't have anything. You got a guardian now? Yeah, you suck. I don't really... Whatever, man. Take that Crypt Rats. Okay. Now, we should do better. The rest is fine.
This hits harder. Also, it causes him to want to play whatever he has. That makes me feel better. We can keep this in hand in case we uh, lose the monarch at some point. He draws like a pestilence. I think that's the best thing for him and the worst thing for us. He's just drawing lands? Okay. I mean, he's gaining a lot of life, but... We're just killing him in card advantage at this point. No Pestilence, buddy. We'll kill him this turn if he doesn't have Pestilence. Okay, cool. Alright, I'll see you guys in the next match. Alright, yes, I'd like to play first. All again. We'll keep this. I think we get rid of the... Uh, we'll get rid of the gate, uh, Grey Merchant. Last turn, we'll see who we're playing against. Great merchant. Okay, so we definitely need to find our Shainer's Edict and Guest Verdict as quickly as possible. So I think I actually want to play Witches this turn. Okay. All right, so we really need draw perfect. Last turn.
Maybe we should have waited. Okay, if he goes to enchant that, we'll just kill it in response. Or we might just kill it at the end of turn. Yeah, let's just kill it. We're going to just... Ooh, we should attack. I think we play the land. Yes, verdict on him, and I think that's probably game. We're going to make him discard the rain core now. We got super lucky on that, by the way. Okay, any scoops? All right, so we definitely want Duress Devas. <clears throat> I think we want Crypt Rats Choking Sands. What do we not want? Arnath seems pretty bad. Uh, Probably take the Disfigures out and the Tendrils out. Probably don't need the witches. Gave a defile or two. All right, let's try this out. Uh, we have a lot of draw. I think we'll try this out. We'll keep.
Gus Reddick is great. Yeah. Then we can destroy this land with all the enchantments on it. Still think I just destroy this land. Or we could distress and defile. Yeah, so I think I take this because it's the cheapest to ca cast. And we'll defile this right now. Destroy this because it gets rid of a lot of enchantments. Make it harder for me to cast stuff. Tag ourselves, play land, rest them, take one of the mask. All right, we're going to play Thorn of the Black Rose just to start drawing extra cards. Make him start discarding a bunch every turn. And he's probably going to lose. Yep. All right. I'll see you guys in the next one. All right. Yes, I'd like to play first. Uh, we'll keep. We'll try this out. We have Disfigure or Cycling, depending on what he plays. Okay.
We're definitely disfiguring that. And we're going to cycle. We're going to play Chittering Rats. We're going to pass turn. Okay, so I think this matchup is actually pretty good for us. Like, we have a lot of removal. Then out the sideboard, we get, like, duresses. One of the black rows probably isn't the best, though. What are we going to side out? That's fine. We have Defile for that. Witches are probably not good either. We can play Bog. Target them. File this dude. Play a witch. Thing for two. I mean, we miss sequence that with Bog, but I don't think they play anything out of the graveyard. <coughs> okay, he's got another fiend. Last turn. Not very nice, sir. Take four, I guess. Then we can cast this for seven devotion next turn. Seems pretty good. Yep, that's a thing. We'll take seven, sure. Hopefully he doesn't have counter spell. Else that would suck. If he had two spells and team or battle rage, he would win. Okay, he scoops. Okay. <clears throat> like I said, we definitely want to rest. Don't think we want Thorn of the Black Rose. Liliana Spectre seems interesting. I like Defiles, I like 
uh, disfigures of Nasha like on Earth. Eba Gang seems kind of slow. Take a witch out. Take one tendrils out. We're gonna keep if we can get both witches out and he doesn't kill him then <clears throat> we can pick off his guys one by one. Playland pass turn. All right, let's get the witch out there. Eventually, we'll draw lands too, which will open these all up. But we can still at least cast these three. Probably either looking for lands or looking for removal for this. I'm guessing he's looking for lands. Or maybe both. It was both. Okay. Land. That is a land. We'll play this. Play which. Pass turn. Maybe he has the Cyclops dude. Eh. Alright. Play land. Play Chittering Rats. Pass turn. mean sure he's gonna need some amount of mutant growth for this to work so you can go for like team or bow rage and mutant growth is the only way we lose. So I think we just block and then even if he uses team or bow rage, we let it go through. Because that's only 18 damage. Fine.
We might just have lightning bolt. That would suck. If we get a land, we're just gonna play this guy. Okay, if he has lightning bolt, we lose. Maybe I was just being too protective. Or maybe I should just chainers edict that turn before. If he goes lightning bolt to the face, we're gonna tendrils our own guy. It's gonna feel terrible. Yeah, counter or something. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, so we were we were too. Yeah. Okay, we we played that wrong. I played that wrong. Uh, yes, I'd like to play first. We will keep. I even forgot that we had the cottage. We'll sign and build ourselves, hopefully to gain that third land so we can start dropping specters. Or we can play Witch. I like playing Witch. In case he has Delver. Also, if he goes like... Turn 2 for that thing. We got hella lucky. Now we'll just start doing specters. Uh, file this. Guess verdict. That was what I was gonna do. I should have been. The, I should have swung with this guy too. Like did it before combat. Well, I definitely need an answer. What's going on? Well, one, two, for that equals to the swamp, that counts as a swamp, so we'll just tendrils right now. Pack for three. Pass turn.
Okay. Liliana Spectre. Well, and defile that dude. That should be game, I think. Trying to see if he uh, had mutagen growth game too. I think he's left already. Okay, um, I think we can keep this. The, it's a little slow with the lands we have, but uh, maybe we can draw uh, untapped land. But we're gonna try this out. We're gonna keep this. All right. Wow, we're playing against another monoblock control. He's gonna hit one of our creatures. Mildly annoying. We're going to play Bajukabog, target them. Play Barrymore. We can start playing Rager after Rager next turn. Try to smooth out our draws. It's weird that he doesn't have about turn three. Is this a uh, corrupt control? That's what I'm thinking it is. So hand hate's probably gonna be really good against this guy. Well, we're going to try to wait to play the Witch's Coddle to, uh, Cottage. Uh, that's not going to, that's not very good for us. All right, so we are going to try to sign in blood, get a different land. Happy with that swamp. Then we're going to guest verdict them, keep up defile. And we're going to swing for four. And cycle Baron more. Because if he plays another one, yeah, we don't have an answer. But we can cycle this. We'll have an answer officially next turn with Witch's Coddle. Cottage. I don't know why I keep saying Coddle. I'm just dumb. Ooh. Okay, so we're gonna play Witch's Cottage. Play that, yes. We're gonna defile that dude. Back. Unblocked. Force him to have defile or disfigure. And he scoops. All right, so Maybe he's just drawing bad. Okay, so we're definitely going to use Horn of the Black Rose. I think the stress is a definite, I think. I don't think witches are good. Actually, yeah, witches are probably bad. 
This figure's probably bad. Unearth seems great. Gonna add to Ress's. Or do we want Liliana Spectre? All this removal is good. Now the question is, do we want Duress? Or do we want Liliana Spectre? Actually, I'm going to try out Duress. I mean, uh, Liliana Spectre. I, don't, I keep saying the wrong thing. We're going to try out Liliana Spectre. I do like to stress over this is because it can hit anything. So it's less of a dead draw later. Yeah, I feel like those are less of a dead draw later on. Um. Yeah, we definitely have to Mulligan. Uh, we'll give this a shot. Keep this. We'll get rid of one of the swamps, I guess. This is a slow hand. But, I mean, we can cycle both of these. I mean, now we just have five lands. So, this is going to be an uphill battle, to say the least. Watch, we're going to draw land. Oh, we did it. Oh, sweet. Okay. Now the question if we're going to play Bajuka Bug or a Swamp next turn, it depends on what we draw. To be honest. We're going to play a Swamp just to distress him. Okay, Lily on the Spectre is what we're taking. He has two removal. We'll bog him next turn. That's the worst draw for us. I mean, it's a good draw for him. The worst draw that we wanted to see. So we'll defile that, play bog, and cycle more. And we can start playing Chittering Rats. That seems pretty good. He has a Chittering Rats. That's bad for us. So we'll put one of his two Defiles on top of his deck. And then we have Rager to progress ours next turn. Yep. We'll take two, that happens. You defile this? You got your own Rager. Okay, well we're gonna definitely trade if he attacks. Because I don't know when I'll get this next, so. Unearth is great. Now the question is, do we want to draw or hurt his draw? I think we want to draw, actually. I think we want to move forward. Keep up Defile for the moment. No, I mean, that hurts. It really does hurt. Okay, top deck, Thorn of the Black Rose. That's what we need right now. Yeah, I don't like that the witches. Witches aren't very good in this matchup. Seems like a dead draw. We're just gonna play the gray merchant. 
past turn. Sure. Okay, he's top decking. We have Chainer's Edict, so. Again, it comes down to who top decks better at this point. We'll take the one, that's fine. Roll Chainer's Edict and hope he doesn't get a discard. Or a creature. Pretty good. Okay. Sign and Blood and Liliana Spectres are both pretty good. We would like removal, so we're gonna go for Sign and Blood first. See if we can get removal. Do we wanna play Chittering Rats, I guess then? Force him to have removal. Might lose this mark. But we can go and pack his hand and everything. Yeah, that's not good. Ugh. Okay, land would be pretty good, so we could play two creatures. Not, we'll probably go with Rager into something else. See what we draw. Now we need land. <laughs> we need land to be able to play most of this. We have a few turns before you can like completely turn. I mean, yeah, look at our hand, man. You can do what you gotta do, buddy. Yeah. He's all like, oh, wow. Again, we're going to do Rager just to try to draw land so we can play two spells a turn. Yes, Verdict works, I guess. The Hell Spell Bomb something, but we don't really have anything in the graveyard right now. Need land. Come on, land. He has a removal of, like, and uses, oh god. He got me good! I was so excited! I was like, oh, I can get the Monarch. Come on, man. What the? Mmm. I hate.
Dude, we're gonna hit a pocket lands when we don't have any cards in hand. And it's gonna drive me nuts. And then we're gonna lose. And he's gonna win because he's kept the monarch because we have drawn very poorly. I mean I hate. We got our other Thorn of the Black Rose then or something? Like god damn this is getting annoying. Just play this, I guess. Make his card advantage not that bad, uh, that good. Not gonna have anything left by the time this happens. Now we get the. I hate this game. Can't stand it. Oh, we're going to so lose. We're going to lose. Drives me nuts. Yep. Killing us in card advantage. Killing us in card advantage. Damn, he's throwing drawn all his thorn in the black rose. Huh. Okay. Well, we're just gonna play this guy just straight up. Bye, land. Should start. Yeah, there you go. Maybe I should bring crypt rats in. <laughs> I think I don't know how I'm gonna win. I'm gonna try to force him to like kill us though. Take two to the face. And crypt rats. We would brought crypt rats in, then we would have had like an out. We have a lot of lands left. So that's beautiful. At least we can draw for a turn. The land. Great.
Huh. Okay. Maybe, so, maybe I'm in a misplay of I should have started playing these and then kept the cards and the three costs in hand to play them multiples on one turn. Probably where I messed up. Yeah, that's probably where I messed up earlier. Alright, so we're gonna... Hopefully... I mean, I don't even know what we could draw at this point. Go on to the next. Take a crypt rats over a guest verdict, just a one for one trade. Alright, yes, I'd like to play first. I will keep. He's probably going to take Trittering Rat since this is the earliest play. Also, it messes with his draw. He did not. Okay. Well, we lucked out on Trittering Rats there. So we're going to distress him, see what he's got in hand. He has Thorn of the Black Rose, Sign and Blood. Painter's Edict. We are going to take the Thorn of the Black Rose. There will be no Marnock for any of us. You top decked the vest. Okay, sure. Must be nice. Must be nice. We need to get our chain. I mean, we didn't really get our sign and bloods last game either, and we went through like 40 cards. Maybe I should have kept that back. That was actually probably the wrong move. I should have kept that back. He's gonna maybe use Trainer's Edict? No, he's trying to find a land. This is good for later, I guess. Thing for two. Wow, okay. Thank you. Beautiful. Uh, I think we don't bog him. I think we wait. We are probably going to lose.
God damn, I'm bad at this game. I don't even want to play it because he's just going to take it right back. Like, I want to have removal. Could I draw removal, like, for a few turns? I'm, I'm done at this point. I don't think we can recover. Alright, uh, this hand's actually pretty good. We're going to keep this. Okay, nice. The mirror match, it looks like. I'm getting a sign of blood is pretty good for him. We're going to go witches. We're going to play chittering rats. Like card advantage, kind of. So he's ahead of us a little bit. So him having divest is probably going to be pretty bad for us. Like, ugh. So we have all the removal, but we need we need card advantage actually. Nope. Okay. That counts as card advantage. That's eh. He's gonna yep, okay. Gonna be probably a long match, though we do have lots of answers. Yeah, in response, guess verdict.
See, if he draws all his card advantage before we draw ours, he's most likely going to win. Because that's what this game comes down to. I don't really care to play that, to be honest. I'd rather wait till we have... Like, we're, like, cheating it in or something. Cycle that. Okay, let's see what we... I mean, he's never gonna resolve a creature, I guess. I guess we'll tendrils this time. And we're eventually also going to hit a big pocket of lands, like he has. There we go. What are we going to play with this? What do we get? Chittering Rats is great. We will discard this figure. Yeah. I never saw that coming. On Earth would be pretty good too. Play land. Play sign and blood. Play Thorn of the Black Rose. Probably get rid of Tendrils of Corruption. And unless he plays Thorn of the Black Rose right here, right now, we're probably in a solid spot. Yeah, especially Chittering Rats into Rager is probably going to be pretty good. Play this, put Gray Merchant on top. Uh, so we'll definitely unearth. Bring back Rager, I guess. Play a land. Chittering rats. Attack. Flash this dude in. Hit him. And that's going to be game. Okay. So, Thorn of the Black Rose. The rest distress. Again, I don't think I like witches. Don't think we need as many disfigures. We could probably shave a few lands, actually. Yeah, we'll, we'll try it like that. All right, Um, we have plenty of lands. Yeah, I think we keep this. He goes like turn one to rest. I'm gonna be pretty upset. He didn't. Okay. Question is, do we want? I 
I think I'm going to play the Baron more. I kind of want to keep this till later. Maybe he plays a creature. That's what we're hoping. That's fine. We'll put the file on top. We'll guess verdict that guy. Then we'll sign and blood ourselves, hopefully drawing lands. Play this. We can start stringing this together. We'll use the unearth on it next turn. Because chances are he's going to remove it. I'm being greedy with this, I know, but I'm gonna go this route. Just need one more swamp. Alright, so we have the option of trying to go for Ninja if he doesn't remove it. If he does remove it, I think we just go for Thorn of the Black Rose. Okay, so we're going to swing... If he blocks, we're going to defile and play another Rager. Or Thorn of the Black Rose. I don't know why I'm, I'm being dumb. And we should be able to ride all this to victory. We'll probably go get... Rest, take that. Tendrils, this guy. Pack. But, uh, Chitting Rats on top. That should be game, because all he has is a Swamp in hand, and... Just gonna play this to have more mana. Uh, 
Uh, we'll just discard this. Discard this. All right, and next turn, we'll just go for the win. And that's game. All right, so we went 4 and 1, which is pretty solid. And if we would have drawn a little bit better or played a little bit better in that first mono black uh, ma uh mirror match, then we probably would have had a decent chance at 5 0. Uh, okay, not too terrible. A lot of points. I like that. And Stomping Ground's not bad, and Risk Factor. All right, so I'm pretty happy with all that. Uh, thanks a lot for watching. Uh, please like and subscribe if you have not yet, and I will see you guys in the uh, next video. Thanks a lot.